So what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be checking your chest and your lungs and check that there's um, uh, your lungs are breathing properly for you and that everything is a-okay. So let's get to it. So what we'll do to begin with is I'm just going to have a look at the um, um, the basic appearance of your of your chest. So I'm checking for symmetry and any lumps, bumps, or lesions. And your chest seems perfectly normal. Can't see any scars or anything. I wonder, can I get you to lift up this arm for me on this side? And I'm just going to check um, the lateral side. Yeah, good. Alrighty, and if you can do the same on the other side for me. Yeah, that is perfect. And what I'm going to do next, I'm not wearing gloves today just to get better purchase on on the um, checking the integrity of the uh, the skin and feeling for any lumps or bumps underneath the skin. So um, if I get you to, um, I'm just going to place my hands either side of your chest, uh, just on your rib cage. I'd like you to breathe in for me and out and in and out. Perfect. Okay. So I'm just going to palpate in between your ribs. Now this is uh, called the intercostal space. Just between your ribs and I'm going to work my way down. If you can just breathe normally for me. Yeah. Good. All right, that's fine. Now, what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to palpate just along the uh, the clavicles, along the, the, the top here, just for check, to check for any, any lesions or masses or lumps or bumps. Okay, good. And I'm just going to palpate here at the apical part of your lungs, just to check if there's anything going on. Okay. Good. Uh huh. That's perfect. All right. So I'm going to work my way down the sternum, and we're feeling for anything unusual. But my friend, that looks and feels absolutely perfect. That's great. So far, so good. So, now, this seems a little bit counterintuitive, but I'm going to have a look at your face. But before we do that, if I can get you to hold your hands out like this for me, that's good. Okay. Alrighty. And if you can keep them just like that for me, just for, just for a few seconds. Mm-hmm. Okay, and if you can hold your hands this way for me, that is perfect. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Good. So I'm checking for any tremors that you may have, but you're fine, totally relaxed, that's good. If I can get you to hold your hands out again, just like that for me, and what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to press on the ends of your fingers and what this does I just check what they call or what we call being medical people uh, the capillary refill so when I press the ends of your fingers they go white and then they go back to their normal color and if there was anything untoward they didn't fill up properly again with 
color, then we may have a problem. Mm -hmm. That is great. Good for you. Okay. So what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to have a, a look at your face. So if you can um, just relax for me. And what I'm doing is just checking the, um, the pallor uh, of your face and to see if there's any abnormalities or any giveaway um, signs that your breathing and your lungs aren't working, aren't working properly. So no, no, you're looking good. No sign of ptosis or anything which is drooping of the, of the eyelids. And so you're looking good so far. All right, so what I'm gonna do next is I'm just going to check your lymph nodes. So I'm just going to um, have a feel on either side of your neck. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna reach just behind your ears just to check the Postericular lymph nodes. Okay, good. And just around the back of your head, so there you go. Sorry, getting a little close. Sorry about that. Okay, good. Just having a little bit of a feel around the back of your head. And that is perfect. Good. Alrighty, so if you could um, lift your chin up just a little bit, and I'm just going to Feel just underneath your jaw, um, just the lymph nodes that live here. How you doing? Yeah, okay, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so far so good. So what I'd like you to do next, I'm just going to check the coloration of your tongue. So if I get you to open your mouth nice and wide for me, ah, uh, like this, that is perfect. And if you can stick your tongue out for me. Mm -hmm. If you can raise your tongue to the roof of your mouth. Yeah. Nice pink coloration. That is fine. Everything so far is looking a-okay. So just going to check your neck now, so if I can get you to turn a little bit, uh, just so your nose is pointing somewhere over there. And what I'm doing next is just checking the um, signs for any pulsation on the side of your neck. Mm -hmm. That's fine. If you can turn your head the other side, just so it's looking somewhere over there for me. And we're just assessing the JVP, which is entirely normal. Okay, good. So, no visible pulsation there, so everything is looking good. Okay, so this so what I'm going to do next is I'm going to again just palpate the um, the front of your chest. I'm going to go a little bit deeper this time. So um, if you relax for me, that's good. And I'm just going to just palpate the front of your chest. And let's work down the sternum. And if you can tell me if you feel any pain or tenderness just as I'm pressing in. Mm -hmm. All okay? Good. All right, that's fine. So if you relax just for a second or two, and it's going to catch up with my notes. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do next 
Um, so far everything has worked out fine, but I'm going to um, do something now called percussion, where I just tap um, parts of your chest and parts of your back as well. So uh, again, if you take a deep breath and out and relax. Okay, good. So I'm just going to just palpate just along the clavicle on both sides. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you take a deep breath from here and out, that's great, good. Okay, so I need to work on the lateral sides now of your chest. So if you can lift up this arm for me, and again, and I'll work my way down. If you can tell me if you feel any pain or discomfort. Mm-hmm. Perfect, good. So we'll just do the other side. If you can lift your arm up a little bit, a little bit more. Yeah, perfect, good. So. Mm -hmm. That's great, good. All right, yeah, no. Uh, sign of fluid or mass or lesions there so everything so far is a-okay so what I'll do next is what I forgot to do at the beginning is to check your pulse so if you can um, just hold your hand down for me and I'm just going to uh, feel with my fingers on the side I'm going to count to 15 15. Pulse is absolutely normal. Okay. That's fine. So, what we'll do next is um, have a listen more deeply inside your chest. So, um, what I want you to do is, uh, if you could take big deep breaths in and out, and um, if you can breathe through your mouth just so you get a good lot of air uh, inside. I'm just going to Place this on the top, so if you can breathe in and down and in and down. Okay, good. And in and down. Okay, good. In and down. Good. Okay, you're doing very, very well. And in. In and out. Perfect. And in and out. Yeah, good. that's fine. Okay, so we're going to do the same down your sides now, um, just to check the lateral uh, on each side. So if you can kind of turn just a little bit for me. And I'm just going to pop this up against the side. Sorry, it's a little bit cold, but sure you can stand it so same again big deep breath in and out and in and out and in and out perfect good same again on the other side so uh, okay if you lift your that's it good and in and out. Good. In and out. Good. And in and out. It's as good as it gets. Yeah, no fluid, no lesions, no masses, 
nothing like that, it's all good to go. Now, what we're going to do next is um, we're just going to do uh, have a look along your back. So I'm just going to palpate your back. So if I get you to um, just turn right the way around for me, and uh, I'm just going to palpate um, just along the top of your shoulders first. That's good. All right, and just along the top of your lungs on this side. Okay. And I'm working just down the midline of your back. Yeah, if you turn a little bit further, that's perfect. Good. Okay, good. Okay. Now my hands are nice and warm now, hopefully. <laughs> so I'm going to cut my hands just on either side of your, your spine, just on the, the lower parts of your back, the well of your back. And what I want you to do is, if you can breathe in for me and then out, on my say so so and this checks your your lung expansion whether it's the same on either side so um, uh, if you can breathe in nice big breath through your mouth perfect and out okay good and once more in and out yeah it's as good as it gets you, my friend, are doing very, very well. Now, what we need to do next, uh, again, along your back, I'm just going to put the edge of my hand along your back like this. And what I want you to do is, in a nice, uh, clear voice, nice and loud, say 99. Okay? All right. So, again, if you turn a little bit further this way, and what I want you to do this time is if you can fold your arms like this, okay? So, and this gets your shoulder blades, your scapula out of the way so I can actually hear your, your lungs, there's nothing in the way. So if I pop this on your back and if you can say 99, good, 99, good, 99. 99, and working my way down the midline, 99, 99, 99, excellent, good. So, yeah, vibrations are normal, which again um, gives an indication that there's no fluid or masses or any lesions on the inside there. So. Excellent. So what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to um, percuss your back. So again, if you can, there you go, just turn around a little bit for me. And I'm uh, just going to just along the top. Okay, so if I get you to do this again for me, just so I can have a good indication of how your lungs are doing. Okay, so let's try and last release. So if you turn a little bit more, that is perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll just do, do the other side now. How you doing? Good. That is great. Excellent. Lungs are clear. So I'm just going to have another listen uh, to your back with my trusty stethoscope. So again, there you go. Good. And if you can turn just slightly for me. Okay. Excellent. I'm just going to pop this up against your chest. Okay. And if you can breathe in for me. And out. 
in and out and in and out okay good and in and out in and out My friend, you are as healthy as a horse. Is that an expression? I just made it up. You're very healthy. <laughs> so what we'll do is uh, we will see you again for your next checkup in, say, six months' time. Um, if you have any issues between now and then, of course, just pop back in. But um, you are very, very healthy. And I have no concerns about your breathing, your chest, or your lungs at all. So, we will see you again next time. Thank you very much.